Right, hi everybody. A quick update on the electrical system. Uh, you can see I installed my forward battery, uh, my number two. It's a Group 27 AGM, which is an absorbed glass mat battery. It's uh, permanently sealed. It doesn't vent. Uh, so that's a good battery to have in, this, in a closed settee like that. Um, it's sitting on a custom marine plywood and epoxy pedestal that I made for it uh, to keep it level and also keep it off of the water line that it runs underneath it. Uh, another thing you'll notice is that um, I went back and forth about battery cables and you know, thought about spending $300 on what that was going to cost me and decided to, to make my own. I got some, uh, some heavy duty, thick stranded uh, 6 gauge wire and uh, red and black is about, f about 45 cents a foot, uh, so less than a dollar a foot total, and um, uh, stripped off the ends. Uh, you know, tinned them myself with solder, and then uh, crimped on the you know the the tinned uh, connectors at uh, West Marine. Uh, coated the open part of that with uh, liquid tape, and then taped over that. So, I think those that's going to be pretty good. Um, it's not as thick as a regular battery cab cable. I think my voltage drop is going to be okay, especially with the low loads that the boat's going to be having. You know, I don't have a obviously don't have a, a high compression diesel that I need to start, so I think that's going to be fine. Um, and then just paying around, uh, never mind the mess in the back. Here's kind of the utility pole here with the uh, the, the VHF 550 on it, and also my my uh, short power outlet, which is running my huge uh, happy. Uh, uh, wet vac. There's my battery charge. You can see it says it's charging both batteries right now happily because the shore power is on. And if I rotate around, uh, the last thing I'll show you here is the new tw uh, 12 volt distribution panel. Uh, se seven of the breakers running right now. Uh, my stereo is actually going to go right where that little West Marine plug is right here. Uh, that that uh, Fusion Audio, uh, I'm really looking forward to getting that in. And I'm going to move that outlet actually to over here. I'm going to put it on this side here because that's where a great place to leave your cell phone to charge which is what I use that for primarily anyway. Uh, everything back here is pretty much the same. Uh, still a bit of a mess down there I need to straighten out but there's my AB selector uh, and up here my um, uh, short power and then the mess that is my my instrumentation wiring but that's a work in progress too. But just a quick update and uh, I'll do another one after we get everything in.